welcome to Big Day Downtown, the series. Can't talk about downtown Halifax without mentioning the incredible restaurants. So, I get to go try a few. I'm gonna stop in and check out some mouth-watering dishes from some of the city's best dining spots. We're here at Morris East, uh, a beautiful little restaurant, so cute, and they serve wood fire grilled pizzas, that's their specialty. I'm enjoying one right now with beautiful peaches and prosciutto, and I'm lucky enough to be sitting with the owner, Jenny Dobbs, and head chef, Lauren Marshall. Like, what, why pizza? What got you involved in, in this, and what, what really made you want to do that particular dish? Um, I love pizza, it's my favorite food, and uh, I really wanted, when I want, I've always wanted to own a restaurant, and when I was thinking about all the possibilities, I knew that it was really important for me to source artisanal ingredients, mm -hmm. so, and local ingredients, and uh, to, to take advantage of what Nova Scotia has to offer. And Lauren, what about for you? The reason why I've been taken here is because I'd always originally liked to eat at this restaurant and yeah. I love the simplicity of it and with a past of Italian food and working in fine dining restaurants I kind of got to mix the both and not have to do super fine dining but still get to do simple and beautiful and work with wonderful ingredients and I, I love that we are supporting all our local farmers. And you guys have a new um, little stand at the market now, is that right? We do. Yeah, we're selling uh, some of our bottled goods. We're selling some chili oil. Uh, we have a raspberry daiquiri mix using Nova Scotia raspberries. Lauren makes phenomenal pâtés and uh, rosemary olive oil crackers nice. and different rillettes. So we have our charcuterie down there as well. Thanks so much for chatting with us and for letting me sample this wonderful pizza. And now we're at Bistro Le Coq, one of Argyle Street's newest restaurants. I'm sitting here with Ashley Davis, the chef de cuisine at Bistro Le Coq. Thank you so much for joining us. You're very welcome. Um, so it's all about French food here. We're, <laughs> we're in French country. So yes. what makes French cuisine different from the other types of cuisine available on Argyle and in the area? Uh, mostly butter. Yes. <laughs> uh, cream, more butter. Uh, some more cream. Um, it's it's just non-pretentious food. Um, mm -hmm. It's something that you know you don't have to pull things out of to, to try to eat your meal. It's uh -huh. it's just good home cooked French cuisine. So kind of like a rustic or oh very rustic cooking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, you just it's just not pretentious. For this dish right here that's driving me crazy with its <laughs> aroma, um, what do we have? Um, here you have a actual half a chicken. Mm -hmm. um, it's marinated in Dijon mustard and thyme, mm -hmm. and then we actually roast the birds whole mm -hmm. uh, to keep all of their juices in there, so they're nice and juicy when you they're not dried out. You don't want uh -uh. dried out meat. Mm -mm. Um, and we make our pan jus out of the drippings off of the chicken. Okay. Um, basically, we just add some thyme to it mm -hmm. and and some butter. Yes. Um, as per usual. And uh, we put our beautiful hand cut fries with it that we make in house mm -hmm. and uh, also some truffle aioli. Beautiful. For you to dip them in. Well, I can't wait to uh, tuck into this little dish. Mm -hmm. Thanks so much for You're chatting with welcome. us. You're very welcome. Very welcome. That was an excellent meal. There's almost 200 spots to eat in downtown Halifax. You can try Chinese, Korean, I just had French and Italian. So come on downtown tonight and try something new.